Zoe Saldana has been heating up red carpets all over the world lately, promoting Star Trek Into Darkness. But how did she look so great while doing it? Health and wellness reporter Zalana Momini recently worked with Zoe's trainer to find out how. Welcome, Z. Hi, Matt. Yeah, I recently spoke to Zoe's trainer, Steve Moyer, who also cooks for his clients and runs a meal delivery business. He told me about her favorite foods and some of the things she likes to eat. She's such a red carpet favorite she time is. and time again. What she did she is. say about her diet? You know, he was telling me that she actually loves to cook and she's not a fan of fad diets. So let's check it out. Fitness goes hand in hand with a healthy diet. She's a very reasonable eater. Nothing, no fad diets, moderation, <laughs> um, nothing crazy. Um, on occasion, I cook for her with my meal delivery business. Reasonable. Like that. Yes, it's a good word. <laughs> if we really need to fine tune some things that can change the diet as far as calories and how much protein, cut the carbs, depending on what she's looking for. Um, but in general, just in moderation, everything reasonable. She's just a reasonable, smart eater. Great to hear how reasonable she is when it comes to food. And it sounds like they kind of change her diet depending on the movie role needs. Right, when they're prepping for a role, he was telling me, you know, it's not about no carbs or, or less carbs. It's, it's about getting the right amount of calories based on her activity level to maintain a healthy weight. So there's really no one fits all strategy. Okay. Everything starts with calories. And then when you get more specific, it comes down to how much protein is in those calories, how much carbs, how much fat. And then you have to take into account everyone's likes, dislikes. So uh, whatever the goal is, I try to structure her diet uh, according to her likes, dislikes, um, any allergies, schedule. Okay, everybody wants to know what are some of her favorite things to eat? Well, she loves a variety of vegetables and she does lean toward clean, unprocessed foods. She likes lentils a lot. She, she tends to gravitate toward a macrobiotic oh, lifestyle. Great. but. Um, it, like I said, it's not set in stone. Mm -hmm. She will enjoy pasta. She will enjoy any food, um, but it's in moderation. So it's nothing, it's nothing crazy. It's good to see that she seems really balanced with she what is. she's eating. Right, and you know, that's really the key to sustaining long-term health. And the only foods that Steve was telling me he encourages his clients to stay away from are trans fats and artificial sweeteners. Everything else is pretty much fair game. So it's about being balanced with your eating and knowing what you need, what your body needs. And we can never say this tip enough, work out, work out, work Absolutely. out. Absolutely, definitely, definitely. You know, she started her career as a ballerina, so she's very serious about working out. I actually did a video on Pop Sugar Fitness with Steve about her upper body workout, how she gets those beautiful toned shoulders oh. so you should check it out for sure very good i thought you were looking good oh, thank very you good. yeah he you definitely good, shaped me out oh. <laughs> all right thanks so much thanks.